Good evening and welcome. I'm Cody Holia. And I'm Ann McCloy. Saratoga Springs police officer Nathan Baker is now suspended without pay after this exchange with a man who recorded the entire thing. Adam Rapika, the man who got that face full of pepper spray, was charged, among other things, with resisting arrest. Today, prosecutors dropped those charges. Rapika is set to sue, and the head of Saratoga's police force wants this officer fired. Is Officer Baker still a member of the police department? As of right now, yes. That's Saratoga Springs Police Chief Greg Veach, who's actually pushing to have Officer Nathan Baker terminated. Hello, license registration. Here's the exchange that started it all. What crime have I committed? Okay. Step out of the vehicle. Adam Rupika, a self-proclaimed cop watcher, says he flipped Baker the bird a few weeks back. Officer Baker pulled Rupika over, and the exchange escalated. Step out of the vehicle. You're under arrest for disorderly conduct. Step out. That's not a charge for... Step out of the vehicle. You're under arrest for disorderly conduct. That hurts. It's, it's not right. Rupika maintains he was exercising his First Amendment rights. He was arrested and charged with having an obstructed view in his car and resisting arrest. But today in court, prosecutors dropped those charges. We can't prove the two charges against Mr. Rupika beyond a reasonable doubt, which is the standard we're required to prove the case. Are you disappointed prosecutors dropped these charges? Well, I respect the decision of the prosecutor, the district attorney in this case, not to move forward with uh, the criminal charges. Uh, the criminal charges are rightfully and should be disposed of in criminal court. Chief Veach suspended Officer Baker without pay. He'll have a disciplinary hearing within the next month. In the meantime, Rapika and his attorneys are gearing up to sue the officer and the city. Mr. Rapika's constitutional rights were severely violated. He was arrested without cause. He was pepper sprayed without cause. He was held against his will without cause. His first, fourth, and eighth amendment rights were violated by the Saratoga Springs Police Department. Now, Chief Veach tells me today the department's internal investigation is still very much in full swing. And he doesn't take his request to terminate Baker lightly. He says the public expects officers will be held accountable for their actions. We'll keep an eye on this story. We'll let you know what happens.